Hi guys, this is Bhargavi Pillai and welcome back to my channel. First of all, Happy Halloween! So this is one festival that I really, really look forward uh, for because most of the time, generally, I am in the US during the season and uh, it is such a celebrated season over there and with the kind of costumes, the makeup, what I see on people over there, the kind of extra effort what they take is just marvelous. It's just, um, I don't know, I'm just left with no words and uh, this was one of the tours of mine, but this was way long back. I was in New York and I ended up going to see the Halloween parade. And I was just left with no words to see the kind of effort people had taken for their costumes, for their makeups. And I just saw some people with just their bare body and their body was fully painted. So then I gave it a thought and I was like, why not? Since the Halloween season is around the corner. So I wanted to curate this look for you guys and this is what it turned out to be so if you guys want to know how i created this look so then keep on watching and before that guys you know what you have to do don't forget to subscribe to my channel like this video and follow me on my social media handles like to do my eyes first and then my base so let's get this thing started so you can use any concealer I am using the wet and wild called the medium peach yes okay so I'm using a small mirror here and you guys might be wondering why am I using such a light uh, color concealer because the color what I'm going to be using I have to make sure that the color pops up really nice and since we're using the red here today so a lighter concealer is always the best I have the concealers which are somewhat just my skin tone or even now just probably one shade uh, uh, lighter to my skin tone. So can you see how light my eyes look? So just taking a powder and just dabbing it to conceal all the concealer and uh, And I like to keep my steps really simple and not apply like thin eyeshadows or something. I just like to simplify the steps so it gets really easier for us so let's get to business so here i'm using the Huda beauty rose gold palette which is the remastered one so out of this the first color one i'm going to be using is a suede which is this one and i'm taking a blending brush this is by elf it's a fluffy um, blending brush so with the help of that i am just Today's makeup is all about gothic look because it's Halloween! This is again Essence of Beauty brush. It's like one of those very flat brushes like that, yet kind of fluffy. And with the help of this brush, I am taking the color Mad. I am taking the color Man Eater. It's this deep red color here. And Oh no! 
I just realized <laughs> during this entire video that I had covered my face. <laughs> oh God. I'm taking the color copper here. Darkening the corners of the eyes. You guys could use a black as well, but I I prefer browns more over than black. So that's a personal preference. Magneto again and just slightly increasing the redness since I really want my eyes to pop. Perfectly splendid <laughs> and time for some kajal. So I have a rose gold color kajal but when you need it you don't find it so I'm just going ahead with a black kajal you can use anything I have the Maybelline colossal one which works perfectly fine on my eyes so just putting the kajal on my waterline post the kajal I'm going to be taking a small blending brush like this this is by color bar you can see this there. So with the help of that, I'm just going to be smudging the kajal what I have put on the waterline. I feel I can go a little more, right? Yes. I feel I'm not too sober with the kajal. Let me put some more guys. Because it's Halloween. Can you believe what I just did right now? Can you see this? I was just going to tell you that there used to be a time Anyways, I'm going to blend it now I just used to be putting a thick line under my eyes and at that point of time actually that used to be fashion and then I grew out of it and that's what I just did right now so, these cartridges dry out so quickly, it's insane, it's just insane. Okay, so, to rectify this, I have an idea. So what I'm going to do is, it's just very simple, I'm going to take the color black truffle, that is because I've done this goof up, like if you guys can see, there's just this little cartridge which came, so I'm taking this round okay, it's my baby's hair <laughs> so I'm taking this um, flat fluffy brush and with the help of that I am just yes that's about it, problem solved So if you want, you guys can leave it like this, but I'm just going to go one step further and just get a little more experimental and I will be taking the color Man Eater once again with the help of the same brush. I'm going to be putting that color all under my waterline. This is a Vega brush, a flat brush like this. So with the help of this, I'm taking the color black truffle once again and just slightly putting very close to my upper lash line. I'm taking the same flat brush again. I 
it a bit, right? And okay, just quickly check it out small. That's about it, so let me just quickly go do my foundation and come right back! So voila guys, this is how the entire look has turned out to be. I have gone very easy breezy with the blush because since the whole look in itself is so loud and you could probably even go with a little softer or nude lips but since it's Halloween and I wanted to go all out there so I have gone with this dark deep brown color which is by Kylie it's called the Coat K if I'm right I will leave the link to it down below in the description box and I hope you guys liked this entire Halloween look what I've put together for you guys and if you do please don't forget to try this and tag me on Instagram so I could share your pictures over there and thank you so much once again for watching the entire video till then take good care of yourself and love you guys